Now to an NBC10 exclusive. She was a rising star, singer, and songwriter, but was shot and killed by an obsessed fan, according to police. Today, though, Marlton native Christina Grimmie's voice is hitting the airwaves all over the world. Only NBC10 Sydney Long spoke to the star's family and the young woman from her hometown who will help Grimmie's legacy continue to rock on. They are lyrics that just might give you the chills in a single that's been out for just hours. It is exciting. It is bittersweet. 16-year-old singer and songwriter Ryan Brown of Marlton is singing duet with the late Christina Grimmie. Having her raw, unfinished music is peering directly into her soul. It's hard to do those things alone. Grimmie, also from Marlton, garnered the love of music fans all over the world on the sixth season of The Voice. She was shot and killed outside this Orlando concert venue in June of 2016. Grimmie's brother Marcus tackled the shooter who later turned the gun on himself. But today, nearly six years later... If I had a billion dollars, all the rings upon my hand... The song is about overcoming people who try to bring you down. Ryan, who was just 10 years old when Grimmy died, is still in awe by the star's rise to fame. I perform in front of the mirror with a hairbrush, and now that it's finally real, it almost feels like, okay, am I gonna wake up? Is this, is this fake? She was given the opportunity to finish Grimmy's song. When you heard the lyrics, what resonated with you about what she had written? It was such an uplifting kind of yeah kind of song it was like we're gonna rule the world and it just seemed like that is what I wanted to carry on for her legacy it was like a family favorite I would listen to the rough track that she yeah. that they made in my car Marcus Grimmy plays guitar in the song and co-wrote rule the world with Ryan where his sister left off rule the world she wrote when she was 14 15 in her room. This break for Brown was born by a friendship after Ryan's dad, then mayor of Marlton, Randy Brown, helped organize Grimmy's funeral. It was attended by thousands. She has big shoes to fill to do a duet with Christina. Grammy award-winning music producer Joe Niccolo of Audubon PA mixed the record. There's no second chance with this. There's not like, well, we missed it on this Christina Ryan song. We'll just get it on the next one. There is no tomorrow. The single dropping just one day before Grimmy would have turned 28. Christina can't tour. She can't do interviews. But being able to us to do a couple little things and then Ryan to be able to, the spotlight can wash out on her right. with Christina's voice around it. Being 16 and being able to do all of this is a dream come true. Reporting in Audubon, PA, Sydney Long, NBC 10 News.